deaths. What we did in Department of Health was put out warnings to hospitals, to old people's homes, and caterers saying, please be careful, use pasteurized egg, um, and if you're using shell eggs, make sure that they're cooked properly. Behind the scenes, we were frantically trying to get the Ministry of Agriculture, Fisheries and Food, who were responsible, to do something uh, through the farming industry and through yeah. retailers. But they kept coming back and saying there wasn't a problem. Meanwhile, our, our issue, of course, was public health. And I was worried that during the summer of 1989, the following year, we would have our hospitals full of seriously ill people with every kidney dialysis machine in the country in use, with intensive care wards full of people with a preventable disease. So I went public and I warned everybody through the ITN news. Uh, one uh, memorable Saturday night, 10 million people heard it and it wasn't edited and I got my message across. Now, I never said, don't eat eggs. Uh, scientific information was that they were fine if you cooked them. But the following week, six million people did not buy eggs and all hell broke loose. Do I have any regrets? Uh, no, I don't, because I was more worried about the health of people than I was of uh, chickens. And I was really, you know, very worried indeed that um, we were going to have far more deaths on our hands. In fact, the level of infection continued at that rate for some years. Until eventually the egg industry itself got their act together, started spending their own money, cleaning up and realizing they were producing food and they had to do it in uh, a regime of the highest standards, the highest cleanliness standards. It took them a long time to get uh, everything sorted out, but they did. And then they came to me in the spring of 2004, so 15 years later, and they said, we've done it. We do not sell contaminated eggs anymore. Please, will you help us tell everybody? Uh, and, and I did. I've never accepted any money for it. I've never been willing to be in an employment role with them of any kind or a PR role with them. But I think they've done an absolutely brilliant job. The UK Egg Producers Council, as it is now, I think are absolutely superb. And they deserve a lot of praise and recognition. They sell eggs under the Lion brand. So my message to everybody is, if you're buying eggs in Britain, you can be pretty sure they're safe. And if you want to be absolutely certain, you buy them with the lion stamp. And that means that the farmer's concern, the producer's concern, have made an enormous amount of effort to ensure that their laying flocks are clean, that they're vaccinated, and they have a testing regime, which I think is second to none. I'm quite proud of my little part in uh, making sure that that happens. Yeah. And I'm very glad to be able to say so. You can have your soft-boiled egg today in Britain, provided it's got a little iron on. It's safe.